long standoff ending with the suspect in custody. Authorities say it began when the man shot at a Pulaski County Sheriff's deputy who was there trying to serve an eviction notice. The man then barricaded himself in the home on Calvary Trail near Canis Road in Little Rock. That is where we find Catherine Thornberry. Catherine, you have been at the scene all day. What did you see happen? Well, Bob and Laura, I did say the suspect did come out of the house on his own. Right now, you can see the street behind me is all clear. But from 10 this morning to about two hours ago, officers, deputies, and crisis negotiators were just filling the streets. Tuesday morning, people living along Calgary Trail in West Little Rock woke up to sirens blaring. Stepped outside, saw several police officers. Um, driving by at a high rate of speed. Damon Hill was looking at a police standoff at a house down the street. That morning, a Pulaski County Sheriff's deputy was trying to serve an eviction notice. That's when they say the deputy was shot at by the suspect. At that point, authorities say the suspect barricaded himself inside the home. Our deputy was not heard during this particular incident, but as you can see from the cars behind, all law enforcement agencies have responded to the scene. Pulaski County Sheriff's deputies, Little Rock Police, Arkansas State Police, and crisis negotiators all trying to get the suspect out and neighbors expressing concern. Hopefully that it does not uh, escalate to something real serious to where they have to storm the home or, you know, because God knows who's in the house. Crisis negotiators make contact with the suspect over the phone and hours later, the suspect came out of the house and the standoff came to an end. And we'll be sure to let you know if we learn anything else. Reporting live from West Little Rock, I'm Catherine Thornberry. Back to you.